Hello everybody, this is the one and only Mr. LP, Steven Sykes, host of Enlightenment Radio, we're part of Legacy, internetradio.com, and also the Sykes Town Group. And I have a wonderful and joyful and just a beautiful guest. And I'm going to let her say her name. I'm Tammy Pinkson, hi everybody. How are you doing today? I'm great, nice, nice to be here. You behaving yourself? Never. And okay, that's a good honest answer. <laughs> so how's, the, how's life in today in Virginia for you? Um, it's great. Today was a nice day. I'm blessed to be here. Um, blessed, period. So, good day. Well, we finally got you off the plane. You know, I had to hunt you down from Japan. You were somewhere in the North Pole talking to Santa. And we came back here to Richmond. I did not know there was express flights from there, so I wanted to check out my Travelocity site. <laughs> so, uh, what's been going on with you? Let's catch up with you. What's been going on, Miss Miss Pink? I always have a lot going on. Um, we're preparing for New York Fashion Week in February okay. with VA models. Um, <clears throat> shout out to Cole Nicole and Jasmine and Nicole, Miguel, all my models, my staff, VA model staff. Um, Words of Wisdom Magazine, we're looking to go into six stores in January. Okay. So we're extremely excited about that. Stores um, in New York or Virginia or where? New York, Virginia, and Georgia. Okay, cool. All right. and. Um, you know, my magazine's already sold internationally going online, so I'm, you know, really excited about that. Um, so, you know, check out Words of Wisdom magazine. Um, we just hired a new, a new manager, a new editor, so we're gearing up for 2016. Wordsofwisdommagazine.com, or how does it yeah, V-A-M, Words of Wisdom. V -A okay, not a problem. We're going to have to check that out. So you've been very heavily, as we saw online, you've been heavily in the photo and uh, video game. I'm sorry, not video game, but you play video games. But uh, video no video games. No so, time for video games. No time for video games. Okay, uh, but you know you you're heavily in the video and uh, photography uh, business all the time. Yes, I am. I actually own, own a film company called Clockboys Films. We are going to be launching the first international t television series from Virginia, and um, it aired January twenty eighth on Man TV. Mm -hmm. I'm also a photographer. I own True Art Image Photography. Um, we have. You know, I've shot celebrities, um, Jim Jones, Cameron, um, Bianca Golden, just to name a few. So, you know, I do very well with my photography as well. Okay. Now, with doing all of these different things, one thing and this is a good question to ask is why uh, stay so busy with all these different things? What, what gave you the entrepreneurial spirit? <clears throat> um, my, my, my parents are entrepreneurs. Both of my parents own their own business. Um, my father, um, Randall's Logging, is the third generation of Randall's Logging. So it's been, it's, a, it's something that I was born with. I was born boss. Man, boss. So you like to be in control? Always. Okay. <laughs> Always. Now, what, what's the difference with, um, you know, with the Clock Boys uh, TV production and TV show? You'll see a bunch of different similar productions. Mm -hmm. uh, in, in, uh, is this a reality show or a TV show? Or? Um, no. Clock Boys, um, Clock Boys TV series. Well, Clock Boys Films is, and Clock Boys TV series is two different things. Okay. Um, Clock Boys, with Clock Boys Films, we do a lot of different types of genre, dramas and movies. We have a scary movie coming out. We have a, a Lifetime movie type movie coming out. We have drama, we have comedy, we have realistic, we have reality shows. Which one I'm in? Uh, let's go for reality show. Oh, okay. The, reality okay, show. we go with the reality show. Yeah. So you have all these different projects and films with it, um, and you got different directors and things. And yes, things. yes. What's kind of, what got you into, because you've been in the photography, the video work, and the modeling game so for so long. What, was this a natural transition, or was this something additional that you wanted to add to your repertoire? Um, well, actually, it kind of just fell in my lap. Um, I manage artists. Um, I manage artists as well under Royal Radio Management. I have a radio station called Royal Radio, and I also manage artists under Royal Radio Management. And one of my artists was already cast in, this, in the TV series Clock Boys. And when I went to go meet the director because I wanted my artist to have a bigger role in the film. So I went to go meet with him and you know, me and Low C we, we clicked right away. Um, he explained to me what his ideas were, um, what the T V series was about, and I was really um, blown away by the, his writing skills and the way the T V series was coming. Okay. So I definitely was excited when he asked me to be a partner in Clockboard's film with him. Awesome. So now when you're involved uh, with that, uh, you're serving as a producer, an assistant, and things like that. Um, I am CEO of the company. He is COO of the company, and I'm also executive producer. 
So how does it feel being a product executive producer when you see now a big movement? There, there were, um, for those who may not know, there were always women behind films, but now we're starting to get the limelight, the credit, and the forefront. How do you feel about being the next generation wave of women who are now taking a lead on the production side and producing? Um, I do. I feel proud. I mean, you know, we work really hard. Um, the cast works really hard. Um, you know, Losi works really hard in writing. We, we work really hard, but it's exciting to be, you know, in the forefront. Not just as a, as a woman, but as a, a Virginia resident. We are making history here in Virginia with the Clockwork TV series. We are employing people in our community. We are getting our community involved. Over Thanksgiving, uh, we collected food for a month and then we cooked the food and gave free food out to anybody who needed food on Thanksgiving. Anybody who was alone on Thanksgiving, they came out to play jigs and ate with us. And mm. so, I me, mean, it's not just um, about being a woman behind the scenes, it's about a whole Virginia movement and making sure that people know Virginia has talent here. That's one thing that's out there. Virginia does have talent, and one of those things that we definitely need to uh, expand upon. Uh, so we got January, we have uh, the Cloudboy Films, and yes. the TV series, and we have uh, New York Fashion Week. Yes. What's going to be featured in New York Fashion Week uh, this time of year for you? Um, New York Fashion Week this time of year is always very cold, so it's, you have to get your mind ready for that. You have to get your mind right for that. It's always extremely cold um, in New York this time of year. But um, last year, we were fortunate enough to do New York Fashion Week twice. We did it in, in February, we did it in September. So this year, we're looking forward to the same success. All right. Now, what is the next step for VA Models? Um, the next step for VA Models is um, we have integrated to online or training classes for models. Um, we are integrating a, a system where we are able to have one-on-one -on -one contact with models via video and things like that, where we're able to train models all around the world and get them prepared for New York Fashion Week under the VA Models umbrella. Now, what are some of the places you have visited with your scope of work and around the world and stuff? Um, I've been to Miami. Um, I've been to um, Georgia. Um, Georgia's my second home. So, shout out to Kim Swain um, and all my, my family out there in Georgia. Daniel, watch him on World Star Hip Hop Question Show. Check him out. It's hilarious. Um, so, Georgia, I love Georgia. New York, um, Maryland, I'm in Maryland a lot um, doing shows and stuff out there. Shout out to Maryland. Um, and that's, you know, kind of where I stay in that. Okay. Now, with both staying on the road and stuff like that is one of the more important things is to stay healthy as much as possible. What's some of the things that you do to try to stay healthy and keep your energy up, your mind right, all those different things? Um, I just focus on why I'm doing all this. I just focus on my babies and that's the reason why I do all this. So if I stay focused, stay grounded, and don't like, don't get distracted by the fact I have to travel, don't get distracted by what I have to do, just do it. Okay. So one, that's one of the things that's out there, uh, sometimes procrastination is uh, one of the key issues in this film, that uh, what's going to be in this industry that people uh, struggle with and you just have to go ahead and keep moving forward. Yeah, absolutely. Um, distractions are, are part of life, they come, you know, it's going to come, but you know what I'm saying, I stay focused. I don't let things distract me, I don't let things bother me, I'm not concerned with it, I don't care. You know what I'm saying, I stay focused on, on my goals and ambitions, and if you're not part of the solution, and you're part of the problem. Exactly. What's uh, what's your favorite place in the world to visit besides New York and Virginia and Maryland and Georgia and Miami? Uh, <laughs> I would say. Um, or what would you like to go? If you could? I would say Jamaica. I would love to go to Jamaica. Oh, uh, that's easy. Yes. Everybody says Jamaica, Hawaii. Yeah, Hawaii. Exactly. I, but I am. I'm going to be going to Jamaica in April. You know, I'm, I'm hosting a cruise okay. uh, on Norwegian Cruise Line, and I'm going to be going to the Bahamas and Jamaica. Disney World. So, if you guys want to come, look me up on Facebook and you can join the cruise with me. Uh, uh, Cabo is very nice. Oh, okay. So, you got to try Cabo. Uh, I think I went to Cabo during spring break in college. Mm. But, you know. That's a different story. <laughs> Let's go rewind it right now. Let's go to the story. <laughs> okay, what happens is what happens in Cabo stays in Cabo. Okay, that's not a problem. We, we won't delve into that this time. So, uh, are you originally from Virginia? Um, yeah, well, uh, yeah, I was born and raised in New Kent County. No, so how did you find your way out of the country? 
I am not out of the country. <laughs> and, um, I can't, I'm, I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> I still currently live in New Cape County, um, but like I do, um, I do spend a lot of time in the Norfolk, Virginia Beach area. Um, I do spend, you know, at least uh, four to six months of the year in that area filming TV shows and taking care of my business out there. Yeah, being a new kid sometimes is like another country, so I was right there first time. <laughs> <laughs> I like my peace and quiet out in New Kent. It's 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 a safe place. It's quiet. It's I get to safe. relax. <laughs> it's definitely quiet. I have to play with my shotguns. <laughs> <so. laughs> I won't be going near it. <laughs> so we try our best. So um, we got a lot of fans. Uh, 2016 coming up, and you trying to finish up this year strong. Yes. Was Santa Claus good to you this year? Oh, always. Yes. Yes. What are you getting? Because uh, what Santa Claus is getting for you this year? Um, some Beats headphones and some jewelry. Jewelry. Yes. Oh, is there, is, is, every kid's probably a cane, Pandora diamonds, Pandora diamonds, and uh, bracelets yes. and all those things. I take, I like the chocolate diamonds out there. I mean, chocolate diamonds are my favorite. This. Chocolate diamonds. You're just going for it, aren't you? <laughs> yes, yes. So chocolate diamonds. Oh, gosh. Who's your favorite designer out there that you, that you really like, that you feel is doing a, a good job and you want to feature? Um, I would say Dee's Couture. I love Dee's Couture. She's very diverse. Hey, Miss D. Yeah, Miss D. Yeah, she um she has a plug. You know, she's anywhere from size zero to you know 24, 26. Like she, she's very diverse. Um, her line, her collection is is beautiful. It never disappoints on the runway. Um, so um, she's a great, great lady. Um, so I mean that is you know. Her personality carries and carries the mm, line. That's wonderful. To be honest with you, we've seen many great clothes, but the people who are the designers are really nasty. Yeah. Also, um, I love breakfast. Mario from breakfast clothing. Mario. Mario. Is, yeah. Mario always. I mean, like no matter where we're at, Virginia. Um, I've seen him in New York a couple of times. No matter where we go with breakfast, um, Mario always wows the crowd. Like if you just look at the crowd when his collection comes on the runway, the detail, it's very impressive. The detail in his work is not just what you might see, uh, and I don't like calling it urban because it's unfair to them. But when you see some people who try to copy him, mm -hmm. it, it, it's, it's not the same. Yeah. And the thing is, the level of detail in his work is very good. Uh, shoes? Shoes. Um, Shay Shoe Haven. Um, I love her shoes, even though I'm still working on how to walk in heels. Don't, don't, don't judge me. Um, also, like Carolyn Harris designs, like she, she normally you know, keeps me laced out with this necklace right here. Mm -hmm. So you're so, going to walk in this inch heels? Uh, give me three inch heels. We can, let's start with that's our fairs. Let's start at three inches. We can't do the seven or anything. <laughs> not yet. We're it's a work in progress. Okay, not a problem. <laughs> we'll work on that. So, um, how can people get in contact with you? Um, you can um, inbox me on Facebook, um, Tammy Pinkston. You can follow me on Instagram at ms.pinkston. How do you put spell this? Because you know people spell mm -hmm. stuff any old kind of way these days. It's Pinkston is. P I N K S T O N. I'm on Snapchat at ms.pinkston. I am on Periscope at ms.pinkston. So you have your Twitter? Twitter, ms.pinkston, VA Models, Words of Wisdom, Royal Radio, Five Boy Film. Yeah, YouTube. Yeah, same. All of the above. Facebook. So YouTube. Yeah, all of the above. Tumblr. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, I have blogs. Instagram. Yeah, I have blogs on Tumblr. Yeah. Is it what's, what's on Instagram? Instagram is Clockboys Films, um, VA Models, Royal Radio, MS. Pinkston, Fam TV. What's the social security number? And wrong answer. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I, I used to catch people from time to time. But I appreciate you coming down and joining us sometime. We've been live at radio. We're going to have you on the live show. And uh, hopefully, everybody can join us every Tuesdays from 7 to 9 on legacyinternetradio.com. You can also find us on Streamer. Uh, I think we're now on uh, iTunes. Uh, we're also uh, also on TuneIn application. Just look up Legacy Internet Radio. We do live shows mostly every night on throughout the week, a whole bunch of different things. On Tuesdays, you're going to hear a lot of different stuff from me throughout the day, uh, documentaries, uh, classical jazz, whatever. So you're going to hear a whole bunch of different things. What's your favorite type of music? Um, old school R&B. Uh, artists? Anna James, Aretha Franklin, Delphonics. Okay. That's good. What's your favorite color? Black. Uh, 
favorite book besides um, the Bible? <laughs> um, hmm. I have a lot of favorite books. They don't get too many books out in New Kent Country. No, because all we have is lots of books. <laughs> um, but you know, I, I love Maya Angelou. Um, I love um, just just I love poems, poetry. It's kind of my thing. Um, who was your favorite movie? Friday, the whole Friday series. <laughs> I love comedy. <laughs> favorite TV show? I'm scandal. Oh gosh, we're gonna leave you alone. I'm, I'm not really gonna mm-hmm. get on that and things of that nature. Uh, if you had a magic wand and you can fix three things immediately, no matter what, what would that be? Um, poverty would be one. Okay. Um, free education Ooh. would be two. And three would be a selfish wish. I don't know what that one got. You tell me. <laughs> okay. What's your selfish wish? We tell the truth here. Follow me on Periscope to find out. Oh, <laughs> easy cheap app. But I appreciate it very much. Make sure you check us out at Live and Radio over on LegacyInternetRadio.com. And you can also email us at liveandradio at gmail.com. That's E N L I V E N radio at gmail.com. Thank you very kindly and may you have a blessed day, everybody. Bye bye.